I've played both Last of Us games, and I adore them. I adore them so much. They are some of the best storytelling I've ever experienced in gaming. I'm not a huge gamer by any means. Even when I do game, I tend to game in the most easier setting because I'm in it for the story. And I think that's the strongest attribute of the Last of Us series, even though the gameplay is phenomenal. And I'm a really shitty video game player. So, you know, if I play on a higher difficulty, I'm not getting anywhere with the story and I'm <laughs> taking too long and not developing the characters, which I have. Uh, during the time of lockdown, I got to experience both Last of Us and Last of Us 2 back to back. And the gameplay itself is quite addicting. Not only is the gameplay addicting, but the characters, you really want to see what happens with them. And now, at this point, I've experienced quite a bit of lifetime with Ellie and Joel. And I'm very excited to see them come to life in this manner. I love Pedro Pascal. I've yet to see any of Bella Ramsey's work. I know I believe she was in Game of Thrones. I didn't see Game of Thrones. Maybe in the future. I'm very excited. So without further ado, this is a long premiere. I believe it's 80 minutes. So that being said, let's jump into the last of us. Here we go. To influenza. Oh shit. Through here. But it doesn't let its victim die. No. It God. Keeps its puppet alive by preventing <sighs> decomposition. This is the most terrifying description of the uh the clickers man for instance the world were to get slightly warmer oh fuck well, now there is reason to evolve now this is scary and we'll be back oh my god oh intro oh my god <laughs> the music's so beautiful wow Neil Druckmann, baby! <laughs> wow! Oh, I can't believe it's real, dude. We're here. It's real. Oh my god, the window! The start screen window! Oh, I'll just open it. It's gonna break my heart. Your t shirt's inside out. <laughs> Shit. Ugh, Joel, come on. <laughs> He's losing it. Oh, Gabriel Luna is Tommy is just so great. <laughs> they, everybody just feels so right. Oh god, Sarah, I'm not ready for this. Oh, the watch. I do, but I'm on Atkins. Huh. It's uh. <laughs> Atkins. We got. Well, we're not going to end of the world now, right? It has to be nighttime. Oh man, just the dread. Oh my god. God, guys, not like this. Not like this, please. I think we can make some cookies. Chocolate chip? Bring some. <sighs> Why? <laughs> Look more like potatoes than cookies. Oh god, Ugh, I don't like it. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, the atmosphere buildup is, huh? It's haunting. You don't get your present. You got me a present. Oh. Oh my life. Oh my fucking god, guys! I'm gonna cry. No. You were never gonna do it for yourself. Oh. Man, no look. Wow, I'm already crying. I, wow, I didn't expect it to hit like that. Whoa. Dude, I really thought we were about to hit it, dude. I know we are, but... Oh, man. Oh, God, no. Oh. Oh. Oh, God. Oh my god, dude, no. What are we doing, Joe? Oh. oh god. Get your seatbelt on. Hold on. God. It's Jimmy's place. Oh god. Alright, hang on. 
Oh man. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my god. Jesus. No. Oh. on me, okay? okay? You don't look anywhere else. <laughs> oh God. No. Two civilians by the river, one of them injured. No. Ankle. I'm sorry, repeat. Hey, no one told you to move. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Sir, we are not sick! I'm sorry. Please don't. No. 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 Okay. You're okay. You're okay. Move your hand, baby. Move your hand. I know, I know, I know, I know, baby, I know, I know. I know this hurts. You're gonna be okay, all right? Baby, listen to me. I gotta get you off, okay? I gotta get you off, all right? You come on, you come on. I know, baby. No, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Tommy, help me! Joe, come on, baby, Phil, I gotta get you off. Come on, come on, make it up. Come on, make Oh my god, dude. And then we'll get you some new clothes, new toys, as many as you want to play with. Oh no, it's false promise, isn't it? Oh, Joe. Damn. That's most like basic printed stuff for documents and money. <sighs> they really did just set everything back. I think it was only like 10 years in the game, but like here it's been 20 and it's intense. Oh. Shit. Oh, hey. Let me out or you're gonna pay, motherfuckers! This is for sure, Ellie. <laughs> oh. Pull out that weapon wheel. Oh, hey. Look at her where she needs to go. Oh, boy. I admire the fight and the cause. Oh, I don't want Ellie to die, though. And I know, like, she won't, but, you know, it's just... It's that moral ambiguity, you know? Greater good versus the attachments made. Whoa. Oh, God. Oh, that's ready to spring. Oh, shit. Wow. First contact. <laughs> the dynamics are just... Perfection. They really translated it amazingly. I mean, it was already, like like this in the game, but, you know, they're just really nailing the importance of Ellie. And her attitude, which is beautiful. It's just so cool seeing the world just for real. It's, I, and it was already realism, but you know, you know what I mean? Just like, it's real people. Gotcha. Babies means trouble. Code broken. <laughs> I love Ellie. Don't move! Ah, our boy. Really, man? Yep. The game is by the book. Jesus Christ. Oh, fuck. All right. Fine. Whoa. Oh, my God. 
Fuck. Oh, man. Oh, fuck. No, no, we gotta move, Joe. Fucking A, man. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, wow, it's just right out of the game. That might be the. <laughs> that might be the best first episode I've ever goddamn seen, man. That is masterfully created. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Um, let me think here. Uh, it's just, that was a lot. So clearly, it broke me in the beginning. And that's wild because I didn't even feel that intense playing the game. But I guess, you know, we, we did, like, get to, like, linger a lot longer in that element. Because I'm pretty sure when the game starts, we're already, like, on the night of Joel's birthday when things are going to start going haywire. Here, we, like, really got to sit with them and get their dynamics. And, you know, it was, it was quick. It wasn't, like, super long. But they did just enough where everything got to last and sit. And it was beautifully handled. And I just... When you know what's coming as well, you really do just like feel that impact, and you know it's just like human empathy. You know, you, like knowing that somebody's about to like lose their child of all people. Woo, guys! Oh, I love the show, dude. I love it. I love it. Um, so, so I mean, I I don't want to sound like a broken record, and, so, and you know, you're gonna hear it from everybody how like how amazing the world building is established, uh, just as well as it was with the game. But here, it's just. It's just so beautifully captured. Like the fact that it's an adaptation. So, you know, it's it's important that they get it right. And it looks like they just nailed it across the board. It's amazing. Um I I don't I don't think I'm gonna get like too too deep because I know uh Carson, Evan, and I are gonna be tackling it on my cup of tea podcast we do, and we're go uh, here on the channel if you like to check it out. And so yeah, this is um this is great. And it'll be a great perspective because Evan is one of the most diehard people of the last of us he's played over the games 10 times over if not more he's always playing the online factions and he's like the most well versed in all the lore with this again like i said i've only played the games uh once through uh, but it did like take a hefty amount of time because they were long games and you know it really got developed but carson he hasn't uh he hasn't finished the games he he barely got into the first game not like interest wise he he loves it uh he you know just people you know finding time to play a whole video game nowadays at our age it's you know it's, it's tricky but he did enjoy it and he really is excited to check this out so it'll be cool to get a, a outsider's perspective uh it, it'll make it kind of tricky to talk uh, about future things to come but if you're a fan of the games and you know what's to come uh you'll get from me and evan uh the code we may be speaking of, uh particularly when it comes to uh, the finale of uh the season presumably being the finale of the game for the first game and very excited to see how they tackle uh the whole elements with part two and whenever we first whenever we finally get to abby and stuff and versus ellie and just all this stuff is really cool so that being said i'm gonna leave it off here i love this and i cannot wait for more so if you enjoy my reaction to The Last of Us, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe, and already ring the bell so you don't miss future reactions to The Last of Us. That being said, hope you have a great day. I'll catch you guys next time.